Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Gaming with me, Tony Mo, and we're here today to launch yet another community challenge. Let me start, though, by saying happy Friday to all of you guys. I also want to give a big shout out to everyone who recently became a patron of my Patreon. Thank you guys for uh, going that extra step to help drive the fan channel forward to, you know, to increase the production value and the scale of my project in the future. That is definitely appreciated, and all of the funds that I gain from Patreon will go towards making the channel just a little bit more kick-ass as we move forward. Now, I'll also be launching my very first behind-the-scenes vlog for patron subscribers. That's going to be dropping at the end of this month, and you'll get one of those at the end of every month. Very lengthy behind-the-scenes discussion, a look at projects that I'm working on, things that I never finished, and I think more importantly, something that a lot of you might be interested in, is sort of how-to stuff, personal tutorials and personal theory on how to grow on YouTube and even on Twitch as I'm learning and discovering more and more about the Twitch platform. So once again, thank you to all of my current Patreons, and thank you to all of you who just continue to watch and share my content. Let's go ahead and launch this week's Community Challenge, guys. I want you to get down with the Grenadiers. Last week, we got some fantastic Hollow Pilot clips sent in. I can't wait to showcase them at the end of this video, but this week, it's all about the big, juicy, explosive weaponry in the Grenadier class in Titanfall 2, whether it be the Softball, the EPG, the SMR, or the infamous Cold War. I want you to head on out and send me your best clips, your best Grenadier bamboozle badness. It could be a long shot EPG midair. It could be an SMR dogfight in the Coliseum. It could be some Cold War goodness in live fire or some multi-stick madness with the softball. Send in your best clips. As always, all the information you need is linked down in the pinned comment. Be sure to follow those rules to the T. Head over to the Google document, follow the form to the T, get your video submitted, and you just might be featured in the top three for next week's community challenge. Other than that, I hope you guys have a great weekend. Have a fun time with the Grenadier class. I know I just did the softball video yesterday. I've been falling in love with the softball once again. I haven't used it since I did my Santa and Slay loadout for my Titanfall 2 Christmas video, so it's been it's been quite a few months now. It's been great to fall back into it and remember just how much fun the Grenadiers could be. And I think there's also a learning experience to be had here, which is really why I wanted to push forward with this challenge. The Grenadiers are a lot about positioning, height advantage, wall running, and also a lot about being able to lead your targets in different environments. Since many of them are projectile based and your projectile can actually be affected by your pilot movement speed, you really have to figure out where you are, how fast you're going, and how fast your target's going each and every time you pull that trigger to get the best chance of those juicy direct hits. Unless you're using the Cold War, in which case, just splatter the ground with death and hope that they die. That's going to be it for me. Once again, have a great weekend, guys. Play some great games. Thank you so much for watching. And as always, remember to play smart, remember to play to challenge yourself, but most importantly, remember to play for fun.